back with another Wednesday video. This one is going to be called The Murderer in Front of My House as Well. I don't know, let's just go right into this video. In front of my house as well. I was house. 12 years old when this happened. 12 years old. My grandmother just got home from the hospital because she had a stroke. Oh shit. She couldn't go up to the second floor of our house in which her room was located. So my uncle, my little brother and I decided that we were going to sleep in her room for a while. No curtains. Before this day happened, my aunt bought a new air conditioner, so the old one would be removed. And of course, there was a hole in the wall for the air conditioner. I covered the hole with some kind of small box before working on the wall, so the air wouldn't come in. Anyway, back to the situation. My uncle and I were playing a mobile game at 3 a.m. when this happened. We played for about an hour or so until my little brother had fallen asleep. While I was paying attention, I suddenly heard a small scratching sound coming from the hole on the wall where I covered it with a box. Its sound was like someone trying to remove it with something. However, I just ignored it at first, because I thought it might be a cat trying to remove the cover. After five minutes, my uncle heard the sound and he whispered in my ear saying, Did you hear that sound? I said, Yeah, I heard it too. But maybe it's just a cat. Forget about it. Don't, don't. After that, we had forgotten about the sound, and we just played again. Until that moment. All of a sudden, my uncle quickly put down his cell phone and started to search with the flashlight. What's wrong? I asked him. But he pointed his finger on his mouth no and pointed it to the window. It was quiet outside. That's weird. I heard someone's footsteps. He talked to me, sitting back next to me. I tried to say that it's nothing, but this time I heard those footsteps. Someone was outside walking around with a creaking sound. So we eventually decided to look for it, opening the box cover. But before we could get closer, my little brother began to scream. We were shocked by that, but then we just laughed thinking our reaction was silly. I talked to my little brother and asked him what happened. He said that he had a nightmare. We laughed again, much bigger this time. Bump! We abruptly froze when we heard loud footsteps from a roof away from us. My heart dropped. What was it? My was uncle said with an anxious voice. We then stayed away from the wall and started panicking. I started to think that it might be a thief who was trying to enter our house. What if he would try to kill us? How are we going to stop him? What should I do? However, despite all my worries, nothing happened after that. There were no footsteps anymore, but my uncle and I had to stay up until the next morning, shivering together. A few days later, my grandpa covered the wall with cement, and that day we were watching the local news, and we heard that one of our neighbors, who lived right next to us, had been murdered. They also reported that the suspect has not been found, oh so God. the cops were struggling to arrest him. We just couldn't believe the news. We just watched the news with our mouth open. That moment became the worst nightmare of my whole life. What if I dared to try to remove that small box to see outside on that day? Oh my god, just any anything, like, just imagining, or just hearing on the news that your, that your neighbor right beside you was murdered. Right beside you. That could have been you, that, that you know, in, in, in this case, it kind of should have been you. I'm not saying that anyone should have died, but, like, you know, it's, in this case, like, it should have been you in a way. And it's like, wow. That's, that's terrifying. Holy crap. I'm glad you're okay, but I feel really bad for your neighbor now. Like, ugh. I hate when people get away with, like, murder and they get away with any crimes. I really want them to be caught, and then it's like they don't get caught, and I get freaking pissed. I get freaking so mad because I'm like, oh, I didn't get caught, you know what I mean? Like, hate that. So freaking mad. What well, it's supposed to show you, make sure, like, in a way that's kind of saying, like, it's good that they didn't investigate in a way, but because they could have been killed, but it's kind of like, if they did investigate, they could have, like, potentially stopped them and stopped a potential murderer, or stopped. The murder that happened, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if I'm just thinking stupid or I don't know what I'm saying, but like, I, I feel like that's, you know, if they called the police or something or if they kind of like investigated a, a little bit to kind of like see what's going on. 
And plus, like, what the hell is the lake? So, like, if there's a hole in your box, like, at first, how the fuck do I kind of keep getting in here? How, how does she keep doing that? My cat got in the drawer from underneath, which makes no sense at all, but I mean, let's help. Well, that's going to be an end of this video, though. Be sure to subscribe, be sure to like this video, and be sure to comment down below what you would have done in that situation. For me, I don't know, because, like, I feel like for a lot of situations, like, I would need to be in it first to know what I would do, but, again, I don't want to be in that situation to know. I'd rather just not know and just, like, think about what I do, but I never want to be in that situation to actually know what I would do, you know what I mean? It seems really cloudy. If, 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 if it's, it looks sunny in here, but it's not that sunny. It's not sunny at all, actually. It's brightish, but it's actually kind of, kind of cloudy, but it actually looks really bright. Don't scratch me, my dude. You already scratched me the other day. You already scratched my foot. Okay, yeah, guys. That's going to be it for this video, though. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.